is Mary Donna Bell Balela, Associate Professor from the Department of Mining, Metallurgical, and Materials Engineering, University of the Philippines. I'm also the founder and head of the Sustainable Electronic Materials Group. The Philippines Human Development Index is improving year after year. To ensure continuous progress and more inclusive growth, it is crucial to develop technologies that will help create jobs and boost the local economy. Progress should not be created at the expense of depleting our natural resources. Our research trusts are highly aimed at the utilization of raw materials locally available in the Philippines as well as in the ASEAN region in the fabrication of sustainable materials for electronics, environmental, and energy applications. We have developed methods to regenerate chemical reagents in the large-scale production of silver nanowires for printed electronics. We are also exploring the use of industrial waste such as used x-ray films as the source of silver. We are also looking into the utilization of agricultural waste such as spent coffee grounds and low-value natural fibers such as kapok in the development of customizable adsorbents for wastewater treatment. Our work addresses issues that are highly relevant both to the Philippines and the ASEAN region, such as clean water, green energy, and the lack of innovative homegrown technology that ultimately promote circular economy. We also do our part in ensuring that the future will have the critical mass of researchers and scientists by holding science outreach programs in less developed towns to encourage students to pursue STEM. Students from rural communities where also came from score very low in science and mathematics achievement tests, which discourages them to pursue a career in science. We also need to address the disconnect between science and society. We need to make them realize that science is more than the generation of knowledge. It is beyond the laboratory. It is a means to help people and help solve the society's problem. I also apply for this prize to provide encouragement to women scientists to continue on with their love and passion for science. The busiest time in the academic life of a woman early career researcher coincides with the time when she is building a family. And this could be very overwhelming. As we encourage more women to pursue science, it is necessary that we provide them continuous support as they navigate through their careers in the academe or in research institutes. When I was given an opportunity by Dr. Balela to pursue graduate studies and at the same time earn, it was a win-win situation for me. I have been training under her supervision for two years now, and not only did I develop self-confidence, but also growth in terms of skills and knowledge. Participating in the Science Prize is also an opportunity for me to show gratitude and honor to all women who paved the way and show that women can do anything. It is also a pledge of taking up the responsibility to push the envelope further so that women can be recognized for their scientific excellence first, before gender.